Cade Cunningham on how he feels after the missed call at the end of tonight's Pistons versus Knicks game. Check out the video. Coach, uh, coach's comments, but he was pretty quick. He's called it the worst call of the season. It happened at the end of the game there. He's uh, called it an abomination. What did you see in the sequence of events there at the end of the game? Didn't go our way. I mean, there's nothing to say, man. There's no words for it. It is what it is. It's how it's been. Got Chicago tomorrow. Is it, is it any more frustrating coming on the heels of what obviously was a call you guys were not thrilled with at the end of the game the other day? Good to remind Like I said, man, it's, it's how the year's going for us. Got another chance at it tomorrow. Um, I mean, I could, <laughs> I could say it all, but another opportunity tomorrow, man. You, uh, you had another terrific game today. You've been really in a groove personally lately. I know, obviously, you want the end result to look different, but what has been the thing that's been clicking for you over the past few weeks to play the way you have? Uh, I mean, just being aggressive. Um. My teammates are giving me the ball in my spots. Um, they're encouraging me, you know, to keep going. So um, I'd say my team. Okay, what's what's the sense of? I don't know if there's a word to describe it, but like, how would you describe it as best you can the mood after a game like this, or after Orlando, knowing that your margin is slim, but you, breaks just aren't going your way. Is it like? Is it an element of frustration? Is it? I'd say live it. That's the word of the day. Live it. Uh, can I ask you about Quentin, Malachi, and uh, Evan? Those guys having an opportunity to come back here with the sun from those guys tonight? Yeah, they had, um, I think all three were really good. Uh, made shots. Um, Malachi got us in some good offense. Um, I thought they really defended really, really well. I thought that was huge for us, especially uh, Quentin. So um, I thought they were really good. Uh, really wanted to pull this game out for them. And last one, 30 points off 17 turnovers. I know that's been something we've talked about this year, but uh, how like how much of that, how much of like you guys being in these tight games, just understanding that you Possession valued a little better, you know, than maybe. Yeah, I mean, one thousand percent. Um, I'm the head of that snake, you know, having the ball in my hand so much. I had five turnovers today. It's just too many. Um, especially, I mean, for them, you know, the points off turnovers and then their offense rebound, their second chance points is what mainly killed us. So, uh, I mean, they're they're big time. Offense rebound the team, but turn the ball over. I mean, it's very controllable. Boxing out is controllable as well. But um, for me, I mean, five turnovers is too many. And, you know, as a team, just getting back and, and trying not to allow them to convert off of those, it's hard whenever there's a lot of ball turnovers. But um, we got to try to limit that as best we can and keep them off the class. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next video, Hoop Life Family.